It's a light heavyweight matchup between Alexander Gustafson and Ovin St. Preux. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Three years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. And now with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, only a professional record of 22 wins, 10 losses. He stands 63 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Knoxville, Tennessee, USA, Ovis Tate. Mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 18 wins, four losses. He stands 65 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, Alexander the Mahler Gustafsson. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. Are uh, you ready? You ready? And we are underway. Orthodox for much of the fight. He's going southpaw here, Joe. Gustafson gets touched by that leg kick attempt. He finds his range with the jab. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. And there he swung with a haymaker. Kick to the body by Gustafson. Straight right hand now just misses. Good combination so far from both men. Gustafson gets caught with that punch. Oh! oh he got clipped oh. there. He got hurt. Back to the feet. Oh, look at this. Who saw that coming? and got the victory. Yeah, you've got to admire the focus and the commitment to getting the finish. You could tell he was in hot pursuit of that submission much earlier in the round, but he didn't want to rush it, so he sets it up beautifully, lets it materialize almost organically, and ultimately gets the desired result. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, Nice technique here on this submission.
So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 22 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, Ovis St. Well, the celebration is on in the corner after the big submission win here tonight. He told us during fight week that he needed to prioritize a finish here. Decisions were not going to be enough to take his career where he wants to take it and expeditiously. So, gets the submission tonight. Now the celebration is on. There got to be few things in all of pro sports as satisfying than to be able to celebrate a UFC win with your coaches and training partners. And thankfully for this young man, now that is all that is left to do.